Hello and welcome to today's virtual ceremony, celebrating our Gold Axe, Distinguished Seniors, and President's Prize winners. This is a special day. It's not how we pictured our ceremony before the coronavirus pandemic. However, nothing can change the fact that you are extraordinary students and you have earned the recognition you are about to receive. The challenge we face today are unique. Even so, alongside the rest of the Lumberjack community, you have adapted to these challenges and proven your resiliency. Today's ceremony is truly a celebration of your accomplishments, dedication, and grit that you have demonstrated time and again over the course of your time at NAU. It is a source of immense pride that you chose to bring your aspirations to NAU, your passion and commitment to your education and to our university has set you apart. Your involvement and leadership in clubs and organizations has energized your peers and added to the vibrancy of NAU. You are committed to serving others, raising awareness, and advocating for a future that improves lives and creates possibilities. Each of your experiences is unique and has helped you forge your own path. In just a few weeks, you will earn your degrees and join nearly 180,000 Lumberjack alumni around the world. Many of you have exciting plans to continue your education, become influential leaders, contribute to social and economic growth, and give back. It is my wish that as alumni, you will be lifelong ambassadors for NAU and through your accomplishments continue to tell our story. You have accomplished so much in your time at Northern Arizona University. Reflect on your achievements and your resiliency. Know that you are prepared for the future. You embody the lumberjack spirit of achievement and service, and I am excited for all that you will accomplish. I would also like to thank our family and friends who have supported you along your journey. Their encouragement and support helped to make your achievements possible. Now I'd like to introduce our Director of Alumni Engagement, Stephanie Smith, whose leadership and dedication helps ensure that NAU remains one of the best alumni networks in the country. Stephanie? Greetings, everyone, and thank you, President Chang. It is an honor to be with you recognizing these exceptional individuals, supporting such a rich and meaningful NAU tradition, and getting to be one of the first few to welcome you, these outstanding lumberjacks, to the NAU alumni family. Seniors, our future remains tied to the strong foundation you have established as distinguished lumberjacks. And I look forward to many opportunities to engage with you as NAU alumni. I challenge each of you to stay connected to this amazing place and continue to contribute your talents as proud and engaged lumberjack alumni. Each semester, the NAU Alumni Association gives all colleges the opportunity to recognize one extraordinary senior from their graduating class. These seniors are selected for their outstanding academic involvement and great involvement within their college. They should have a strong connection to the university now with the hope of a continued relationship with NAU after they graduate. Each dean has identified the individual whom they and their colleagues consider to be the most outstanding graduate in their area. Let us now recognize the selected students for their dedication to academic excellence and campus involvement. From the College of Arts and Letters, Daniela Riviera. An exemplary student, Daniela 
honed her skills in Arabic in a study abroad program in Morocco and refined her French studying in Paris. She is president of the Immigration Action Learning Team, a student club that fosters social awareness of current issues and encourages student leadership. From the College of Education, Tiana Agdepa. Tiana possesses the rare combination of superior dedication as a student, scholarly creativity, and natural leadership. Her intellectual prowess is balanced with the dedication to volunteering and community service. A volunteer for Louis Cupboard, Tiana was also part of the NAU Hapa Hawaiian Club and played intramural soccer for two years. From the College of Engineering, Informatics, and Applied Sciences, Daniel Rivera. In his sophomore year, Daniel was awarded a Goldwater Scholarship in Mechanical Engineering. His bioengineering research helped him land an internship with Bionex Medical Technologies. For his senior design project, Daniel has been working with Dr. Zachary Lerner to develop a wearable upper extremity exoskeleton. He will pursue graduate study at Yale University. From the College of the Environment, Forestry, and Natural Sciences, Genevieve Conley. While on her year abroad in Argentina, Genevieve took ecology courses in Spanish and volunteered as an intern at a national reserve. For her second semester internship in Northern Patagonia, she worked with several endangered species. She was awarded a Hooper Undergraduate Research Award to study ecological interactions affecting an endangered species in Southern Arizona. From the College of Health and Human Services, Chloe Strike. In addition to maintaining a 4.0 GPA, Chloe has been active in community service. She is a member of the Student Philanthropy Council. She was voted president of the dental hygiene class of 2020 and has volunteered at almost every dental public health and educational event offered through the department. From the College of Social and Behavioral Sciences, Wyatt Benson. A 4.0 student, Wyatt is a well-rounded anthropologist stellar in all four fields of the discipline. He has been a volunteer and paid researcher in Dr. Christina Burke's Faunal Lab and served as a teaching assistant. With two other students, Wyatt wrote an abstract and presented a paper for the Society of American Archaeology meetings. From NAU Online and Statewide, Crystal Tapau. In addition to her studies, the U.S. Navy veteran has provided many support services to her fellow veterans. A first-generation university student and mother of two young children, Crystal maintained a 4.0 GPA. After graduation, she plans to work with the Veterans Administration to help connect disabled veterans with education and career resources. From NAU Yuma, Audra Attaway, working as an academic support coach and peer mentor, Audra led many students to complete their associate degrees and pursue additional degrees. An exceptional student, she was awarded the prestigious CSWE Carl A. Scott Scholarship and won honorable mention for a paper she submitted to the Western Social Science Association undergraduate paper competition. From the W.A. Frankie College of Business, Brooks D. Bishop. A student athlete, Brooks maintains the highest academic standards while putting in at least 30 hours per week in practice and games. As the basketball team captain, he was the third leading rebounder in the Big Sky Conference. He is a three-time Golden Eagle Scholar and Big Sky All-Academic Team member. Congratulations once more to all of our distinguished seniors. Now I would like to welcome to the podium Aaron Grisham, Vice President of Student Affairs for the presentation of the Gold Axe Awards.
Thank you, Stephanie. It is my privilege and pleasure to announce this spring's 45 Gold Axe recipients, as well as the faculty and staff member each Gold Axe recipient has named as being the most influential person during their undergraduate career. Please enjoy this brief, brief video that provides the rich history and tradition surrounding the Gold Axe. The, uh, the Copper Axe was the first mascot. It came to us in 33. It's 25 pounds of pure copper. It went to every dance, every commencement, was in every parade, went to football games. The axe itself is a potent symbol for the lumberjacks and the measure of the university. The Gold Axe Award is steeped in rich tradition that goes back to a time when NAU was known as the Arizona State Teachers College at Flagstaff. In 1932, the student body adopted the Copper Axe as the symbol for lumberjack sports. A year later, the student government began awarding small Gold Axe pins to students in recognition of excellence in both the classroom and the community. To this day, the Gold Axe remains the official emblem of the Associated Students of Northern Arizona University and is presented to students in recognition of their outstanding achievement and distinguished service to the university and the greater community. More than 450 eligible graduates applied for the Gold Axe Award this spring, and of them, a committee of 20 reviewers selected 45. These recipients represent the top 1% of this spring's graduating class. Each of you should know that the honor you receive is not only historical, but also select and distinctive to NAU. The following students were selected to receive the 2020 Gold Axe Award. Haciana Alvarez Carrillo, Educator of Influence, Michelle Novelli. While maintaining a 4.0 GPA, Haciana found time to serve as a Bible study leader and worship singer. She was an Educate to Act researcher and presented at the undergraduate symposium. Haciana tutored elementary students with America Reads, organized international student culture nights, and took a mission trip to Haiti where she distributed medicine in Port-au-Prince. Christina Anaya, educator of influence, David Camacho. Honors College student and ambassador, Christina founded the NAU Pre-Veterinary Club and served as its vice president and president. She was diversity committee head of Omega Phi Alpha National Service Sorority. Christina attended the United States Hispanic Leadership Institute Conference and Association of American Colleges and Universities Conference. Her research experience includes the Dogs for Veterans Research Project. Rachel Arnold, Educator of Influence, Sean Thomas. Rachel studied abroad in Costa Rica and Spain. She worked as a resident assistant and community council chair for the Residence Hall Association. Rachel completed her practicum at a trilingual elementary school where she taught Spanish to kindergartners. She volunteered to work with children on Parents' Day Out, an event that allows foster and adoptive parents a day off. Kai Beatty, educate, Educator of Influence, Leah Mundell. Kai founded the Civic Engagement Club and served as its president. They were awarded Outstanding Sociology Student in 2017 and served as principal researcher for a project studying affordable housing policies in Flagstaff. Kai is active in the Repeal Coalition, Keep Flagstaff Together, Democratic Socialists of America, and the City of Flagstaff Housing Commission. Julia Bosco, Educator of Influence, Mary Harmon. Julia's leadership positions on campus have included Secretary of Pine Pals, Vice President of the NAU for All Club, and President of the National Student Speech Language Hearing Association. Julia also served as committee head for the President's Project and Relay for Life. As Secretary of Omega Phi Alpha Service Sorority, she represented NAU at its national convention. Amelia Cromie. 
educator of influence, Jerry Thull. An active member of the Air Force ROTC, Amelia was Silver Wings National Conclave Commander. As Chapter Public Affairs Officer, she boosted their NAU social media by more than 600%. Amelia won the Air Force ROTC Semester Scholarship four times and interned with the Secretary of the Air Force in Public Affairs at the Pentagon. Genevieve Conley, Educator of Influence, Matthew Muchna. As president and founder of Girls Teaching Girls, Genevieve created a service club dedicated to empowering young girls through hands-on STEAM projects. Genevieve spent a year in Argentina through the Interdisciplinary Global Program, where she conducted research into the impact of wild boar and cattle on wetland ecosystems. Her awards include the Undergraduate Sustainability Leadership Award. Sarah Downs. Educator of Influence, Amy Hitt. Sarah is an Honors College student, served as Secretary Treasurer for the Public Relations Student Society of America, and is a member of Lambda Phi at Ada. She worked as a PR and marketing intern at Coconino Community College. Sarah also volunteered to help Camp Kesem and Big Brothers Big Sisters. She served as a True Blue Ambassador and Honors Ambassador Coordinator. Tuesday, Elias, Educator of Influence, Jamie Lloyd. As part of NAU's Residence Hall Association, Tuesday attended five different leadership conferences. She served as the association's president, supervising the executive board and overseeing the budget. Her awards include receiving the First Generation Scholarship and National Association of College and University Residence Halls Communications Coordinator of the Year. Tuesday also worked as an intern in the Arizona Governor's Office. Kiana Etsatiwa Gashwaitiwa, Educator of Influence, Kathleen Frank. Kiana won the title of Miss Indian NAU and then spearheaded the successful campaign to change the event name to Miss Indigenous NAU. She served as President of Connecting Higher Education Indigenously and Treasurer of the United Diversity Council. Kiana worked as a research assistant and participated in an indigenous cultural exchange program to, to Australia and New Zealand. Max Evans, educator of influence, Abe Springer. Max was president of the Geology Club, a Center for International Education Global Ambassador and an NAU First Scholars member. He was awarded a Hooper Undergraduate Research Award and was part of the Springer Research Group. Max's awards include the Vesto M. Slifer Scholarship, Hadley Award Scholarship, and the NAU GO Scholarship. He interned with Semex Resource Management and studied abroad in Australia. Nicole Fournay Bio, Educator of Influence, Adana Romero. An undergraduate research technician at TGen North, Nicole provides DNA sequences for researchers. She participated in the NAU EDGE Leadership Program, helped to found the Prevet Club, and served as its secretary and vice president. An honors college student, Nicole is a member of the National Society of Leadership and Success and studied abroad in Siena, Italy. Kalia Gates, educator of influence, Bernadine Lewis. Co-founder of the Ladies of Truth, Kalia served as vice president of the club formed to empower women of color. She is also the webmaster for Beta Alpha Psi and a member of the Black Student Union. Kalia served as a WA Frankie College of Business ambassador and participated in the Women of Color Symposium. Tyler Gates, educator of influence, Joey Ruiz. Tyler served as an ASNAU senator and a new student government advisor. A PeerJack's mentor, he was awarded the Mentor of the Year Award and more than a Mentor Award. He kick-started the Louis Essentials program to provide students with essential hygiene items. Tyler was also a new Resident Assistant of the Year nominee. Kyle Gabby, Educator of Influence, Garrett Lindbergh. Kyle studied insulin, insulin stability with Dr. Garrick Lindbergh and investigated developmental defects in zebrafish. 
As part of the Interns to Scholars program, he researched the genetics of feral horses. In addition, this Honors College student was accepted into the nationally competitive Eugene and Ruth Roberts Summer Academy. Kyle was president of the Bioengineering Club, and his awards include a NASA space grant. Adriana Granillo, educator of influence, Danny Donaldson. Active with the NAU Kets, Adriana served as its recruitment chair, homecoming chair, and president. She participated in the Lumberjack Leadership Institute and was selected to serve as a presidential leadership fellow. A star program participant, she went on to work as a program assistant, program director, and community mentor for the program to mentor first generation freshmen. Majesty Greer Gibson, educator of influence, Melissa Schonauer. Majesty was a member of the NAU Bad Jacks dance team, NAU Hapa Hawaiian Club, and Black Student Union. Majesty was awarded the Hawaii Emergency Physicians Associated Education Scholarship and the Amy Websdale Hapa Club Scholarship. This Honors College student worked as a research assistant at the, at the Pathogen and Microbiome Institute and presented at the national conferences on undergraduate research. Nadia Jones, educator of influence, Tina Traustador. Nadia was awarded a research initiative for Scientific Enhancement Fellowship, presented posters at two national conferences, and conducted research in Dr. Tina Traustador's lab. Nadia is a member of the Associated Students for Women's Issues, Pi Kappa Phi, American Indian Science and Engineering Society, Council for Undergraduate Research, and the Society for the Advancement of Chicano and Latin American Scientists. Sheridan Jones, Educator of Influence, Matthew Rollman. Serving in multiple leadership positions within Air Force ROTC, Sheridan was Wing Commander, Honor Board Vice President, Chair of Investigations, and Silver Wings Vice President. Sheridan was presented the National Sojourners Award and the American Legion General Military Excellence Award. She participated in the NAU in Greece Study Abroad Program and she volunteered at the Coconino Humane Society and worked as a resident assistant. Jennifer Jun, Educator of Influence, Kevin Chase. A member of First Generation Student Support Services, Jennifer was also a new student government liaison, a board member for Louise Cupboard, a general delegate for Model United Nations, and a global ambassador for the Center for International Education. Jennifer volunteered with the Arizona Best Buddies program, worked as a first generation program assistant, and participated in a study abroad program in Ecuador. Philip Kalanio Pio, educator of influence, Matthew Salongo. Philip served as president of the Student Undergraduate Research Club, secretary of the Bioengineering Club, and a student member of the Society of Toxicology. He was a research assistant mentor and is a member of the American Student Medical Association. Philip was awarded the Golden Eagle Student Athlete Award. He worked with Dr. Matthew Salonga on multiple research projects. Kimberly Kern, educator of influence, William Pedersen. Kimberly was named most outstanding social work student and was selected to present her research into voter suppression of Latinos and Hispanics on the US-Mexican border to the Global Studies Research Network Conference in Canada. She served as an intern with the Arizona Access Program and volunteers as a court-appointed special advocate for children in the foster care system. Amanda LeCount, Educator of Influence, Andrew Schrack Walters. Amanda served as president of NAU Pine Pals and membership director and mental health committee head for Omega Phi Alpha. She volunteered extensively for the Hajoni Foundation, a Flagstaff Day program for adults with disabilities. For her efforts with Hajoni, Amanda was awarded the City of Flagstaff's Volunteer of the Year Award. She also worked as an intern for the NAU Civic Service Institute. Erin Langmead. Educator of Influence, Melissa Griffin. Erin's leadership positions within the Student Health Advocacy Committee include Mental Health Initiative Leader, 
vice president, and president. This honors college student was selected to serve as a presidential leadership fellow and won the Rodney Mathers Award. Aaron worked as a teaching assistant and conducted and presented research on the neuroscience of empathy and compassion. Eric Leiby, educator of influence, Gretchen Gee. Through extensive participation in the Army ROTC program, Eric was awarded the National Order of the Purple Heart, Sons of Union Veterans Award for Leadership, and was the top male in the Ranger Challenge Cadet. He participated in a three-week exchange program in Romania and interned with an Army Psychological Operations Military Information Support Team aligned with U.S. Africa Command. Rebecca Long, Educator of Influence, Lonnie Wadersky. Rebecca participated in a Community Health Assessment for Prevention Intervention Project, surveying the Sun City community and researching ways to reduce heart disease related hospital visits. She taught young adults martial arts through her own karate studio and volunteered with and served as class representative to the Glendale Association of Student Nurses. Rebecca was awarded the Phoenix Law Enforcement Association Police Cadet Scholarship. Pac Sun Lothar, Educator of Influence, Mark Lammer. Pac Sun served as the conference coordinator for the American Society of Civil Engineers Pacific Southwest Conference and as co chair of Green Jacks. She planned and hosted the Better World Seminar Series and was a student outreach coordinator for Take Back the Tap. As part of the Office of Sustainability staff, Paxson helped organize Earth Week and Earth Jam. Carly Lowy, Educator of Influence, Dana Donahue. Carly gave an oral presentation for the research experience for undergraduate program and is working on a manuscript for publication with Dr. Dana Donahue on culture and compassion. Carly won the Most Creative Experimental Method Award at the Undergraduate Symposium. As part of SciCHI, she participated in a community service project, and she also volunteered at the Rocky Mountain Psychological Association Convention. Kylie Mollier, Educator of Influence, Jeff Melander. Kylie was honored with the Academic Success Center's Present Teamwork Award and was named the Academic Peer Mentor of the Year. She has been involved with Louise Cubbard, serving as co-president and volunteering at every bi-weekly distribution. Kylie was vice president of the ambassadors for the College of Environment, Forestry, and Natural Sciences, helping to coordinate the annual Graduate and Career Expo. Madison Martz, educator of influence, David John. While maintaining a 4.0 GPA, Madison served as president of Hashima Bioethics Society. She is a member of the National Society of Collegiate Scholars, served as a health partner's intern, and worked as an undergraduate research assistant at the Pathogen and Bio Microbiome Institute. As assistant to the volunteer coordinator at Flagstaff Medical Center, Mad Madison directs all day-to-day -day emergency department volunteer operations. Aaron McCoy, Educator of Influence, Mary Foulet. As president of the National Residence Hall Honorary, Aaron implemented a service and sustainability initiative on campus. She was the philanthropy and volunteer chair for the Arizona Residential Leadership Conference. This honors college student wrote three national winning, seven regional winning, and seven campus winning of the months. Aaron also worked in Dr. Andy Kopich's lab researching bacteria growth in beer. Helen McLeod, educa educator of influence, Shannon Thompson. International student Helena is a member of the NAU track and field team, a board member of the NCAA Student Athlete Advisory Committee, and was the 2018 Big Sky Indoor Long Jump Champion. Helena received the Golden Eagle Award three times, was twice named to the USTFCCCA All Academic Team, NCAA Division I, and to the Big Sky Winter and Spring All Academic Team three times. 
Anthony Mirabito, Educator of Influence, Matthew Muchna. Anthony is an Honors College student and is co-chair of the Green Fund. He led the effort to revitalize the Yellow Bike Program and helped establish the Green Fund Student Research Grant. Anthony was awarded the Everett A. Ramsey Memorial Scholarship. He conducted an independent research project detailing a business plan for Arizona to reach 100% renewable energy power generation. Sarah Nagovan, Educator of Influence, Robin Martin. Sarah was an honors peer mentor and served as the organization as faculty liaison and vice president. She participated in an interdisciplinary team-based research internship collaborating with the Grand Canyon Trust and Hopi-led Black Mesa Trust to research the plight of a culturally significant stream threatened by groundwater extraction. Sarah was also selected as a Butterfield Lab field research technician. Joseph Ortiz, educator of influence, P. Cody Canning. Joseph was an event coordinator for the NAU Dance Marathon, a fundraiser for the Phoenix Children's Hospital. He served as president of the NAU Climbing Club and volunteered with youth programs at a local climbing gym. For three semesters, Joseph was a first-year experience peer navigator. While taking online courses, he traveled independently for nine months, visiting more than 25 countries. Ryan Peretti, Educator of Influence, Rory Faust. Under Ryan's direction, KJAC Radio Sports saw its highest ever views and became the voice of NAU Ice Jacks. Nominated for the Intercollegiate Broadcasting System's 2020 Best Men's Basketball Play-by-Play, -play, he was the public, announcer, public address announcer for every home NAU soccer game and the NAU Men's Basketball Color Commentator. Ryan also worked as a sports reporter for NAZ Today and The Lumberjack. Mia Pique, Educator of Influence, Michael Ort. Mia spent a year studying and working in Argentina and Ecuador. She served as president of the Alpha Lambda Delta National Honor Society and was a founding member of Girls Teaching Girls. Mia spent a summer conducting geophysical analysis on volcanoes in Mexico and conducted guest research at Harvard University, gathering data from ash she collected in Ecuador. Evelyn Puyama, Educator of Influence, Andrea Sakaptua. As part of a pilot internship program with Hopi Resource Enforcement Services, Evelyn worked as a police officer ranger assistant patrolling historic ruin sites and conducting safety checks, highway patrols, and livestock counts. She was awarded a Hopi Higher Education grant and served as co-president of Abaya Yala University Association. Evelyn worked as a peer mentor in the Office of Indigenous Student Success. Madison Safa, Educator of Influence, Melissa Griffin. A member of Chi Omega Women's Fraternity, Madison served as president of the College Panhellenic Council. She received the Heitzman Family Honors Business Scholarship, Bank of America Scholarship, and Lumberjack Scholars Award. Through her involvement with Chi Omega, Madison helped coordinate numerous philanthropic events to raise money for Make-A-Wish. She has also served and volunteered at the Flagstaff Family Food Center. Jane Sandoval. Educator of Influence, Kathleen Frank. An active member of the American Indian Science and Engineering Society, Jane served as the club's president and senior national student representative. A participant in the interdisciplinary global program, she spent a year in China and served as a global ambassador for the Center for International Education. Jane also served as secretary of Connecting Higher Education Indigenously. Rachel Samukil, Educator of Influence, Don Rivas. As Vice President for Service and then President of Phi Beta Kappa, Rachel coordinated many volunteer projects. She also served as President of the Student Nurses Association and the Out of Pantry Procurement Manager for Louise Cupboard 
and a board member for Women's Way Red Lodge. Rachel's numerous scholarship awards include the Arizona Hazelwood Memorial Nursing Scholarship and the McDonald Roll Scholarship. Mackenzie Tankerary, Educator of Influence, Ryan Holder. A member of the NAU Accidentals, Mackenzie also served as the Acapella Group's treasurer and president. She is a member of the NAU Women's Chorale and recently served at the, as the Chorale's undergraduate conductor. Mackenzie sings for the NAU Shrine of the Ages Choir and the Sedona Academy of Chamber Singers. She was awarded the Ralph E. and Winifred Hess Scholarship. Sierra White, Educator of Influence, Jeffrey Downard. As president, as, as president of Phi Alpha Delta Pre-Law Fraternity, Sierra oversaw all chapter operations. She also served as an executive board member and public relations and marketing chair. This honors college students sang with the Arizona University Women's Chorale and was the safety officer for the NAU club water polo team. She won two Hooper undergraduate research awards. Alicia Eniquez, educator of influence, Michelle Benedict. Pi Beta Phi president, Alicia won the College Panhellenic Council President of the Year Award for 2019. Alicia also participated in a study abroad program studying culture, cuisine, and history in France. She was the lead aide at the National Restaurant Association Summer Institute and volunteered to play the Easter Bunny at Sedona's annual celebration of spring. Congratulations, Gold Axe winners. Now I would like to welcome President Rita Hartung Chang back for the presentation of the President's Prize Awards. Thank you, Erin. The final award to be presented is the university's President's Prize. The President's Prize was first presented in 1922 to the senior who was judged to have contributed the most to the university during that year. Now, 98 years later, I am proud to continue this tradition, and now we honor four students who have contributed significantly to NAU as accomplished scholars, researchers, organizational leaders, volunteers, and our community activists. While our winners have done so in very different ways, each of our President's Prize recipients has left a legacy in their achievements, service, and inspiration. Let's meet our President's Prize recipients whose names are not released until this moment. Our first President's Prize recipient plans to do environmental education work, field technician positions in fire management or botany, or work in environmental policy in a nonprofit organization. An environmental sustainability studies and modern languages major, graduating with a 3.98 GPA, our first President's Prize recipient is Genevieve Conley. Genevieve shared I am most proud of the work I have done creating and implementing Girls Teaching Girls, both on and off campus. D GTG has provided experiences to many young girls who would not otherwise have had opportunities to be heard and develop confidence in their ideas. Working with Killip Elementary, which serves low-income communities of Flagstaff, GTG has provided experiences and projects in STEM that may encourage young women to pursue STEM fields in the future. We have also created a strong presence on the NAU campus, where GTG presented and participated in STEM demonstrations, planned events for women's empowerment on campus, and created important partnerships with other service organizations, both on campus and in the Flagstaff community. I am proud of this accomplishment because we have created an impactful organization without relying on support from a parent organization. GTG was created from an original idea and has blossomed into a program that students are excited and passionate about. I believe 
that GTG has generated an enormous impact on the young girls in the Flagstaff community and provided an opportunity for NAU students to contribute to positive change in the community. Our second President Prize recipient plans to apply for a job at the hospital to become an OR technician. After a few years, she plans to apply to NAU's Physician Assistance Program. Majoring in Biomedical Science with a minor in Chemistry and graduating with a 3.74 cumulative GPA, our second President's Prize recipient is Adriana Granillo. Adriana shared, a first generation college student, that is what I am, and I could not be more proud of myself. Someone who is also proud of me is my Tata, a veteran, a garden lover, and a smart man. My Tata was born and raised in a small border town and never had the opportunity to get a higher education. During my sophomore year, my Tata lost his battle to cancer. Every time I went home to see him, he would say, Miha, how's school? Still getting good grades and enjoying it? Since he did not attend college, having his first grandchild attend a university was something he made sure to mention every time his friends came over. Reflecting on my academic career, my time at NAU has meant that I am loved, supported, and resilient. My Tata was by my side when I first checked into Cowden Hall. Since I had the support of my Tata, I wanted to make the most of my college experience. He has been with me every step of the way, and I know I would not have made it through without his love, support, and pride. He was there with me at Relay for Life when we walked around the track honoring those who have, we have lost to cancer. He was with me when I stayed up late to study for biochemistry, when I earned an A in organic chemistry, and when I was elected as the president of the Kayets. Giving back to the NAU community has given a sense of purpose, and I couldn't have done it without my support systems. This spring, as I accept my bachelor's degree, I won't only be doing it for myself, but my Tata, who will always inspire me to achieve and to do better. Our third recipient, President Prize recipient, plans to continue her education and attend medical school after graduation. Majoring in biomedical science, university honors with minors in psychology and chemistry, and graduating with a 4.0 cumulative GPA, our third President's Prize recipient is Madison Martz. Madison shares, my time at NAU has allowed me numerous and valuable experiences to pursue my passion for learning and accumulating all the knowledge that higher education had to offer. Throughout my undergraduate career, I have worked to maintain this enthusiasm for my education by taking fascinating courses while expanding my knowledge through research, volunteer, and job experiences. I currently work under Dave Wagner and Karina Hall at NAU's PMI on projects funded by the CDC and DITRA to detect the causative organisms in melodosis in, in endemic regions and determine their mechanisms of resilience to common antibodies. I had the incredible opportunity to personally complete the first isolation of a bacterial species called B. thalamidiasis uh, from the Western Hemisphere and present on it at two conferences. Research has opened my eyes to the vast fields of scientific discovery and further developed my appreciation for learning. I have had the chance to expand my personal and professional skill sets through numerous diverse experiences at NAU. I have had the opportunity to serve as a student resource by being a supplemental instruction leader and a supervisor TA for the microbiology labs. In addition to the uh, personal gratification from enabling students to succeed, this also allowed me to improve my leadership and communication skills 
and rekindle my interest in microbiology and molecular genetics. I have also sought ways to get more involved in the Flagstaff community and pursue other professional goals, becoming a provider for differently abled individuals as an employee of Inspire Incorp and Fabus Incorporated has simultaneously been one of the most fulfilling and challenging experiences in my life. I feel that my education and experiences at NAU has given me the drive and confidence to approach all future challenges with the hopes of pursuing further education in medical school after graduation. Our fourth President's Prize recipient plans to apply to the University of Queensland in Brisbane, Australia with an emphasis in uh, petrology and geochemistry, receiving geology and modern languages degrees with an emphasis in Spanish, graduating with a 3.71 GPA, our final President's Prize recipient is Mia Piquet. Mia stated, first generation student is a single, in a single parent family low-income family from Chicago, I doubted I'd ever attend college. But NAU created community, giving me an amazing education in geology and Spanish. NAU made me who I am, providing environments for pursuing my dream of becoming a leader who will change the world. In geology, mentors have encouraged my ambitions. I trek through the Amazon jungle machete in hand to collect ash from the Renovator volcano in Ecuador, gathering data to protect local communities from geological disasters. Working at a volcano observatory for six months led to my involvement in publishing two research papers on volcanic hazard relief. I was awarded a research grant at Harvard University working one-on-one -on -one with the distinguished geochemists. Being in modern languages and the interdisciplinary global program, let me connect my heritage and experience to the energy of people in South America where I taught in Argentina and conversed with Northern Andean natives. On-campus activities honed my leadership skills. As president of Alpha Lambda Delta, I managed a 300 plus student organization working with the board to give back to the community, helping at Flagstaff Family Food Center and conducting food drives. As a founding member of Girls Teaching Girls, I learned the power of mentorship, teaching girls that a woman is strong, smart, and can truly be anything she wants to be. As an honors college peer mentor, I helped freshmen in and out of the classroom. I attended leadership conferences on diversity and equity and represented honors with a major donor. These experiences conveyed the importance of diversity in classrooms and communicating the honors college mission. NAU has my deepest gratitude. I cannot wait to achieve my dreams and give back to NAU in thanks for molding me as a leader, teammate, and better world citizen. Congratulations again to our deserving President's Prize winners. I would like to extend a very special thank you to uh, Kristen Carnes, Beth Bourget, and the outstanding staff in the offices of University Events, Dean of Students, and Alumni Engagement for their great coordination of this special event. Congratulations once again to our Gold Axe winners, our distinguished seniors, and our President's Prize recipients. You have earned this recognition and we thank you for being part of the Lumberjack family. We know you will continue to improve lives and make a difference in the world. It is an exceptional honor uh, to call you Lumberjacks. Keep an eye out for your awards, certificates, and gold axe pins. We will be mailing them to you uh, and uh, to your influential educators and staff after the ceremony. Thank you again for being part of our virtual ceremony.